Hi! <laughs> I'll ne I, I will never get uh, the hang of starting these things. But welcome uh, to my stream, or if you're watching this on YouTube after, welcome to my channel. And <laughs> today we are going to visit the Dreamer household. And it's quite the lot of Sims, I can feel. So, we'll see how it goes. Um, I think I'm just gonna play one day because it's so many sims and it usually takes me a while. Uh, so, <laughs> so <laughs> that, that is what we're going to do, alright? Okay, so uh, do we have some sort of order? Steffi is asleep, I know she's pregnant. Um, do I have name suggestions for her? I do. I got Delilah and Dora, but now the Ottomus family has a Dora. So I don't think we should use that. Um, I think that would have been a fun name to use, but I don't know where I got it from. I think I just thought like it's a name on D. But we have Delilah Dreamer that we haven't named anyone after yet. Uh, we also have Mariana. It's not on D, but I'm kind of over the D nonsense with the Dreamers. <laughs> it's, it's enough, all right? <laughs> anyway, so let's, um, let's, what, what did I say? Mariana? Yes. She was Mariana Matlapin. I don't know how that's supposed to be pronounced. Uh, we also, like Steffi doesn't have any grandparents, so we'll have to use Dirks. And we have used Davis already. And we have used Omar for, for a boy. No, we have not. Uh, I don't know why I said that. I don't, there's no Omar. In my game Omar nope so we have we have used Davis and we have don't oh Omar we don't use these they, they come in to play later we could like we could do a Darren jr. if we wanted to um, I mean why not though <laughs> I can I no I I can feel like we we shouldn't. So what I do is I have my trusty spreadsheet that I, you have seen before, uh, and we have the name letters sheet where we just have all the letters and how many sims are called that. There's a fantastic uh, calculation going on over there so that we can figure out how many are alive it's <laughs> and have this letter there starting in the column for the sims first name you get the idea <laughs> i hope so we just sort uh and we are on o so uh, that that's fantastic so if if there should be twins with two boys we get omar and we can we can just, we could name the other one also on oh that would be fun uh last set of twins that were born in my game i named eivind and hampus so you know usual swedish names <laughs> This is The Sims, where I uh, impose my culture on every sim, regardless. <laughs> so, I was thinking about this, like, is it horrible or is it good? I don't even know. But every sim in this, um, in this save is a, uh, like, it's an atheist with Christian 
relatives or back i mean i don't okay so this is her, how it is in sweden sweden most of the people you meet are going to be atheists or like indifferent or say they're christian but they're really just not <laughs> and we just like do the christian traditions because that's what we do and because that's what we have done for generations since they came in here and like forced us to be christian uh we were heathen before um i mean that's their word for it i need a blanket i'm cold so like in the sims 4 i had this mod for different religions and you have like uh followers of the watcher and cow plant cult and what what have you so that that was fun but i don't have that in this game and I, to be honest i didn't really you know give it too much thought so <laughs> um that that's just how it is now anyway what is the ages? Melinda is 13, so we can't lock in to go to college, but we can lock in because she wants to go to private school. I do believe that we invited a headmaster. I'm pretty sure we did that. So he, he might show up. Also, I have decided against having taxes calculated because it, it it really just was me calculating taxes and it was quite boring like it was fun the first round but now oh Emily is here with some flowers now I don't really care for it so what we do is every Monday we give Oh, so what I did, I, I increased the the, <laughs> the bills instead. Do we have a loan jar somewhere around here? There it is. So we don't have a loan in this family. But we can see global billing is on level 6. I had it on level 3 before and then I like took money from people depending on stuff. But now I'm just... I just put billing up to six, level six and the game will have to handle that for me. Uh, I I think that's better. <laughs> you know, we have a computer here. It, it can handle calculations. So uh, let's let it do that. But what what it doesn't do is it doesn't give a uh, Barnby drug <laughs> that we have in Sweden where you get like each month you get like a thousand Swedish crowns or something like that. like. 1050 I think it is um, for each child so and we are we're going to like just give this family that and we I have I have um, I have made these boxes over here because children and teens usually don't, don't have loans so I made these boxes green and so this family is supposed to get four uh, 4,000 actually. That's nice. So we're just gonna do a caching. Can I do like if I do let let's see if I do this correctly. So we do caching and we set a uh, semicolon afterwards. I do believe that if I set three more semicolons, this should mean four cachings. I'm not sure if it's going to mean five, but it should be four. <laughs> Let's see what happens. So they should end up with 5,000 something. Yeah, that didn't work. <laughs> well, um, maybe that was the Sims one. So let's let's just do caching four times instead. There. <laughs> that That's the same effect. And have us a little save. Now, where, where should we put this money to? Do we have money in bank accounts? We see, it seems that we do not. Because we took all the money out to do the remodeling. Now I kind of want to set the money back. Let's put it in 
Dirk's account. Uh, deposit. So let's check all that that uh, four thousand that he got for <laughs> for having children. And the only reason I'm setting it in a bank account is so that he gets interest and the bills doesn't get increased. Um, because you might say that's fair to increase the bills uh, depending on how much cash they have. But it's, um, it's to a degree that I don't think is reasonable. So it just kind of like eats up all their money and I don't like it. <laughs> so I really, I, I, this is what I do. On the odd occasion that I forget, they get punished for it. <laughs> it's not my fault, uh, except that it is. So the children are going to school today, finally, because we have been enduring the weekend. <laughs> oh God, it's The Sims 2. <laughs> yes, <laughs> we love it. Anyway, we have been enduring the weekend and the children has not been able to do homework even though they want to. Uh, and Dirk here wants to help um, Dean with his homework, but Dean doesn't have any homework, so we haven't been able to do that. And it, it, like, I didn't like it. So, but uh, so now it's Monday, and he will finally go to school and get some homework so that he can get some homework help. So uh, th that's exciting. Um, yes, it is The Sims 2. Uh, I do believe, like, once you start playing The Sims 2 rotationally, it really is superior to all the other games. <laughs> That's what I think anyways. And if you haven't tried it, I do recommend trying it. Uh, if you can, I, I know that there's ways to get it. Um, but according to Swedish law, I'm not allowed to encourage any illegal activities. So I, I'm just going to say that you should do it legally, but I know there's illegal options. <laughs> that's, that's all I'm going to say. <laughs> not encouraging. Uh, and also this is going to take forever because I, I keep pausing and talking and nothing is going to happen <laughs> if I keep doing that. <laughs> I played all the Sims games and I like four more because the changes. All right. Well, you know what I like? I, the Sims 4 definitely has its um, its perks. I do love... I, I don't know if this is going to sound awful. <laughs> but in The Sims 2, everyone has the same body type. Uh, like everybody. So they're e either like fit or normal or fat. <laughs> <laughs> Plus the command mod. Are you talking about MC command center? Because that's essential. I cannot play without it. It's impossible. Anyway, <laughs> so um, in The Sims 4, you can have all sorts of body, body types and uh, big boobs and butts and, you know, all the things. And I really enjoy that. But and so. In that regards, I really miss that sometimes in The Sims 2. There is a mod actually for The Sims 2 for story progression. Uh, I had it in for a little while. It was quite cool. But I figured out that I actually enjoy uh, playing rotationally and managing everything myself. <laughs> so um, I have my ways uh hello you have been selected to try out our new magazine i'm gonna say no because i never do direct them to actually read the magazines so they're just gonna clutter up the, the lot now uh anyway just had to see if you were actually sims 2 it is yes uh i was one of the lucky ones that managed to get the sims to what are you doing oh i'm following the wrong sim 
<laughs> I got The Sims 2 on Origin because they had, like, when they were releasing The Sims 4, they had Sims 2 for free, like, for two days or something. And I snatched it. I, I do have the disc, <laughs> too. So I could install it, but it's way more handy to have it in Origin. Um, and I, I still haven't moved to EA app. I'm, I'm scared, frankly. I, I'm a bit worried that I might lose my games. Have fun, I'm gonna play something myself. Yeah, you, uh, you enjoy that. Have a good time, I hope. Um, I do enjoy playing. So I don't blame you for also enjoying the same thing. <laughs> what are you gonna play though? Oh, you know what you should try if you don't know what you're gonna play? Planet So, oh, that's a good one. But also, uh, I was gifted uh, the Entropy Center and I can really recommend it. It's a really good game. I haven't finished it yet. I'm in the middle of it. Um, but I really enjoy it so far. Uh, but Planet Zoo, that's nice. I have a population comp problem with my <laughs> with my peacocks. There are peacocks everywhere and they poop a lot. Um, what is going on? Okay, Melinda is up because I directed her to do the homework. The cat is in the way. Oh, little cat, you can't be there. Why can't you go around the cat? Try and go around the cat. It's fine. <laughs> she wants to go to private school and college. So that means that she should do her homework in order to achieve that. Dirk got some interest on his bank account. How much does he have now? Four, yeah, 4,200. I keep resetting, but I got told to do the scenario because you learn more. Yeah, I was doing the tutorial, but I think that ended, I think. What was I going to write? Oh, right. Dirk has money in his bank account. Sometimes I note that in case I accidentally remove the mod or something. I don't know what that, why that would happen. All oh, right, everyone is gaining skills faster because it's autumn. I love autumn. <laughs> it feels like cheating, but it's really not. Uh, what is everyone doing? Darren wants to get a grandchild and he wants to max out seven skills. That's probably why he's sitting here reading and Dirk is painting for some reason he wants to gain a skill point so I'm gonna let him do that okay well I thought it was gonna be a chaos but everyone is just doing good stuff who's Dorian wants to have five friends five best friends so maybe he could like send some emails. I don't I don't think he can get to the computer right now though. But we can try. I don't think it's gonna work. Alright, so Melinda wants to be a city planner and Dorian wants to have 20 simultaneous best friends okay <laughs> and he also has a problem with the cat will cats sleep on cat beds i don't know if cats will sleep on cats beds or like pet beds it says pet pillow so i think it should like, so if I put that there, maybe the cat will go and sleep there. Also, this is very weirdly placed. Let's place it over here instead. So maybe the cat will not be in the way so much. <laughs> oh, he could get to the computer. Sometimes I don't know if it will work or not.
What am I doing? All oh, right, he wants he wants best friends. I don't know who he's friends with. Let's just send emails to three different people. I don't know. <laughs> oh, he wanted five. Okay. Well, the rule is you can only send three emails and that rule is very strict and <laughs> I made it up, but I, I feel it's, you know, no, 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 don't find a job. I don't know if it actually takes longer to do this in increments, but I'm going to do it like this anyway. Are you going to finish your homework? Not sure. Well, she has good grades. Oh, well, the homework seems to be gone. That's fantastic. The cat is hungry and the, <laughs> the pet bowl is weird like that so i'm gonna do that and the chat bot is reminding me to save the game better do it <laughs> i think those uh square pet balls are um problematic in a way i think they um they get like diagonal and the cat won't eat from them so, you need to take care of this child. Darren seems to be tired, so we'll let him sleep. And he hasn't, hasn't got any wallpaper. Maybe we put some wallpaper. He seems to like gray and dark red. So let's try and find something like that. The great thing about the wallpaper is that every color has its own swatch like this, so I can just quickly find the wallpapers like I saw, and I really like that. I did see a mod that clumped them together, <laughs> but I, I prefer that I can find the, the colors real quickly. <laughs> there you go. Wait, did I feed the cat? Yes, I did. See, now it can go eat. It didn't go eat before, uh, and I think that was the shape of the of the food bowl. That was. I don't know what, what why they did the food bowls like that, but they did. this table it's so ugly <laughs> that's why i use it <laughs> and it, it, it was real popular too uh, it was like one of those ikea tables a lot of people had them and see the top here is a um, you can you can lift that up and walk around with it but the table is so ugly so i didn't buy it but a lot of people did <sighs> anyway well, he does want to reach creativity level f to five. He does need a body skill point if he uh, is going to be uh, promoted, but he doesn't, he's not in gold or platinum mode. So, so we're not focusing on that. He wants to buy a green energy source. All right, well, we could do that, I think. What are the price for those? Wait. It's under decorations, apparently. Is it in here? What is all these things? Here it is. It's only 600. There you go. I don't remember if this was from a pack, um, but I think that the text is quite funny on it. It says, harness the power of the very sun. State-of-the-art photovoltaic 
What does that word? What is that word? Photovoltaic systems convert otherwise wasted solar rays into utilizable en electric energy. Note, does not harness all the power of the very sun. That would be dangerous. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> They, they just felt they had to put that in there in case someone didn't understand. Good job. Now, should we teach this poor child to walk? Because he, uh, he might grow up this evening. But apparently he's crying first and we're trying to feed him. There you go. Roger. Yeah, he's tired. Let's try and teach him to walk. Darren, I know you mean well, but that's not really uh, helpful. <laughs> you need to repair this. Otherwise, you'll just stand around here doing that all day. <gasps> oh my god, is she dying? No, she's not dying. <laughs> well... You know, she might. I think these are have gone bad. I think. Did they go bad? Can we just grab a drink? Is that fine? Yeah, you're all pee your pants because Darren is uh, busy in here trying to fix the bathtub for you. Uh, I'm sorry about that. That's just the way things go. The cat doesn't seem to want to sleep on that bed. Or does he? Cyber. <laughs> oh, he does. Oh, that's handy. I don't see any like flies or anything coming out of these, so I'm hoping they're okay. Don't want her to die, you know. <laughs> and now they're not okay. Stop. Because now there's flat flies. Clean up. And you know, have, have breakfast, don't die. What is happening now? Okay, we're getting the bills. What is the verdict on the bills? Alright, apparently put him to bed. I told you to s teach him to walk, but that seems quite the opposite. Well. What were you doing over there, mailman? Pow Melon. All right. Well, I'm gonna ignore him for a while. I don't need more Sims in my spreadsheet. I don't know why the game keeps adding new games. No new Sims. Because I think I, I um, installed some mod that was supposed to stop that. I, I don't know. Okay, bills are 489. All right, you need to extract some money to be able to pay that. Uh, bank online, where is it? Bank online, withdraw, let's, let's take a thousand. And then once we're here, you can you know, bank online, pay bills. And it's gonna be fine. Steffi is uh, still alive. <laughs> That's good. Um, I want to change her into maternity so that I can see. Why are you eating chips? No, 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 no. Why can't you resume cooking? Okay. Did you just stop making cereal to have chips instead? Now, what does my spreadsheet say? It says that she is due on Tuesday at 9 a.m. So that's tomorrow. So we'll see. Uh, if we get a baby in this stream or probably not, because I'm probably going to end the stream as soon as it turns Tuesday. We'll see what the time is when that happens.
But right now I'm just waiting for everyone to get home. He wants to buy a car. I'm not sure that's a good idea. Well, you can continue practicing because apparently you would be very happy to get a creativity skill point. But I think his carpool will come before that happens. Well, yeah, you can try. What is Darren doing? He, is he asleep? Yes, he is asleep. He wants to gain a logic skill point and reach mechanical level 6. Let's do the mechanical, I guess. Or... Oh yeah. All right, yes, uh, study mechanical. Okay, you're bored, what's your hobby? Melinda likes music and dance. Do we have some thing to that effect? Should we get her like a musical instrument of some sort maybe? I think that's expensive in this game. Yes, the cheapest musical instrument is 1,500, so we won't be having that. <laughs> but we can buy a uh, little stereo. Don't we have music anywhere? Uh, apparently not. So let's let's do the cheapest one because this this family. Well, if I put this up then it doesn't take any space and they seem to have they seem to be low on space kind of i don't like it there <laughs> well i'm gonna keep it there anyway can i no i can't use it oh that was a mistake oh no okay well i'm probably losing money doing this but what are you do, gonna do? Now I could put it up here. But then it will destruct anyone that's trying to sleep. If I put it on but I'm gonna do it anyway. <laughs> so turn that on and like start dancing or something. And you will have to help the child. Yes, I know that you're bored. That's why I wanted you to dance. Dance. Dance, Melinda. There you go. That's fun, isn't it? <laughs> Dorian thinks that uh, she she's crazy. <laughs> well, isn't this wonderful? <laughs> oh my goodness, I love this. There we go. A nice little picture of Melinda. Sure, because. See, now he wants to sleep and he, she's gonna disturb him. Oh well. We could build him some walls so that he can have his own room. But I don't know. I, I think we're gonna not do it. <laughs> Just for now. Anyway. Whose carpool is this now? Is it one of the teens? No? Is it the cat? No? Oh. It is Melinda. I didn't remember that she had a job. Oh right, Malcolm Landgrab has hired her as a barmaid in in his 
pub like what wh where is it like over there somewhere <laughs> like in club dante over here so she works over here i forgot about that <laughs> I guess she was just there at the right time or something when he needed someone. Her lifetime wish though is to become a city planner. So I don't know. Oh well. And here we have Jerome Turner. And I think this sim... <laughs> I mean, I think it's quite astonishing. Whenever I see this sim, I think I think it's this one anyways. Um, it's one of them. I'm pretty sure. Uh, I When I saw him, I was like, that's Kent Holman. <laughs> and um, you can Google him and see if you agree with me. I don't know. We can uh, we can put glasses on him. <laughs> Maybe it will uh, be more clear if I do. There you go. <laughs> See. I don't know. Maybe it's just me that sees that. I don't. That that's what I see. Now, uh, this guy over here. He wants to buy a cell phone. Maybe I should take him over to the little shack over there uh, to go and buy a cell phone and maybe meet some people. He seems to know quite a lot of people already, but you know, some teens. So uh, I think I'm gonna do that. He's gonna go there. Dean is doing extremely well in school. Yeah, I bet. And now, Dirk isn't at home. I know Dirk wanted to teach Dean about homework, but he's not at home and Dean wants to learn homework. So maybe I ask Darren instead. We're not bringing anyone. <laughs> yes, okay. Fantastic. Put your homework down <laughs> so that I can direct you to. Uh, where are you going with that? So far. All right. Come on. There you go. Ask for homework. Oh, he can ask the teenagers too. Well, uh, Melinda and Dorian isn't at home, sort of. He could ask Steffi, but she's pregnant and usually, you know. I think asking Darren is the smartest choice over here, Darren. There you go. We are going to the all-in-one shack. It's right over there, but I turned off clicking clickable lots because it was annoying me. <laughs> Whenever I had a uh, menu that was covering the lot, it took my input to the menu along with the input to clicking the lot and it kept asking me, do you want to play this lot? Or you can't play this lot because it's other things. And I was like, stop it. <laughs> Otherwise, it's quite handy if you can just click them. It doesn't work, but well. So, over here, I have this visitor controller and I was messing around with it. So I'm just gonna <laughs> check because I think I put like temporarily where is it? Like I have age, so that I only allow teens in here. But I also did, what was it? Characteristics? Yeah, okay, so I was banning straight people, but now I'm not banning them. <laughs> 
Now straight people are allowed here. Oh, he wants to be friends with Lisa Freckles. So let's go and hug her. She is a romance, romance sim. And so she's uh, involved with quite a lot of sims. So that can be uh, a bit problematic. Uh, but Lester Pleasant seems to really love her, so we'll see what happens with that. Maybe he will be able to, you know, get her. <laughs> now Dorian over here, he has a fling with Lisa, uh, but he also likes Sheila Reeves apparently. Um, you know, he's attracted to her. At at least they don't, don't have a good relationship per se but i'm just gonna go and greet everybody we don't need to greet lisa do we need to greet matt yes we do oh and here's benjamin burb i'm Pretty sure he was with Lisa too, but I'm not sure. David Optimus is, is part of my unplayed Optimus family. They just got into winter uh, and he had twin brothers just before this. So. Don't know how that will affect us at all. Over there is Melody Tinker. I just want him to know, you know, everybody. In his age group. They will meet in college probably, but if some of them are not going to college, then it's nice if they meet beforehand. He does want to go to college now, but who knows, when he turns 16 and at, after that, he might not get the want to go to college. We don't know. I have changed that rule back and forth. I can't remember. I had the rule that once you turn 16, you can lock the college want in. But I'm not sure I didn't remove that at some point, but now I don't, I didn't remember that I removed it, so I have it. <laughs> if that makes sense. Who's this? Professor Leonid Selfit, what are you doing here? It's an old team lock. Well, he's gone now. He just did a walk by. Brooke is really upset because, oh my god, Gina is here. Brooke and Gina is not getting along so, so they were both I think we'd skip broke I think that's the the guy they were fighting over and like Gina sort of stole him from under Brooke's nose and the the annoying part was like she did it like just after the Landry family had adopted or like they took first they took Brooke in as a foster child but she's adopted now um and then they also took Gina in and then the the whole boy thing happened and they had a huge fight and since Gina had just moved in it was decided that it was best for her to get back to the orphanage so she's back to the orphanage over a boy and these two could have been sisters but you know, it didn't work out and now I'm afraid that they will fight. They already got, like, they got a minor record. So once they get, uh, become adults, what are you doing? He's getting in, apparently. Well, once they get adults, I'm gonna have them serve that. Oh, with Lisa. Okay. <laughs> They're gonna serve the prison sentence. Um, right now I have them as 
half a year and that doesn't really work in my game so we'll see what happens but brooke seems really upset can we like can i hug her like i'm not attracted to her or dorian is not attracted to her but you know we can be friends he just wants to have like 20 friends so why not stop fighting with her hug her gina you're being really mean There, if I occupy her, <laughs> oh, she didn't like that. Oh well, then let's let's just talk to her then. If I talk to her, then she can't fight with Gina. That, that's good, I guess. But he got his mobile phone, and now it's getting kind of late. And he does want to go to co uh, to college, so uh, he should actually go go home so he can make. He must do his homework, and now he's too tired to do the homework, but he can try. <laughs> oh my God, they're fighting again! But I'm gonna go away, and hopefully, oh my God, they got <laughs> they got the enemies involved. No, that's not good. Which, by the way, uh, pushing someone and doing the slappy things, that's not illegal, that's just not nice. The, the fighting where you get the big cloud, that's the illegal part. That's what you get in prison for. <laughs> so as long as you keep from doing that, but, you know, don't hug people chat with her all right so now now we can go home oh what am i doing there we go hopefully they won't have time to fight did brooke leave too i don't know let's go home the taxi was going the wrong way we should go the other way oh i'm out of coffee that's horrible horrible Helt horribelt, jag har ingen kaffe. So, that's what I think about that. <laughs> okay. Uh, Steffi, what are you doing with your life? You want to get a promotion. You are meeting all the requirement to get a promotion. When is the next work day? Like in two days. Oh well. She also wants to play a computer game, I do believe. So let's have her do that. Then she can play Spore. I must know what it looks like when a same plays with Spore. <laughs> I have that game too. It's a nice game. Not as nice as I thought it was going to be when I first saw uh, Will Wright talking about it. Oh, okay. Well, it is sort of like this, but <laughs> yeah, so she got through the the cell phase and now she got into the creature phase and she's, <laughs> she plays fast. <laughs> is she going to go, oh my goodness. It's it's a, such a fun game. You get to build your creature and walk around with it, and then you get to get go into space with it. It's very funny. <coughs> That's it. All right. Well, she also wants to learn anger management, and I think that's a good idea. Any sim that wants to study anger management should do that because. Hey, did you? Didn't you learn? Where's your homework? Uh, ask for homework help, uh, Darren. So Darren, you uh, you be available for him, okay? Help Dean with homework. Come on. 
stop that. Oh, did he bring Seth home with him? This, this is like confusing. All right. So Seth is someone. <laughs> Seth is the son of Cassandra Dreamer and Darren Dreamer. Like really Cassandra goth. But when Cassandra died, Darren wasn't at home and everything went bad. And, um, and now the headmaster is here. <laughs> so all the children got t taken away and then Darren moved in here to help Dirk out. And now he can't uh, get his children back because there's no room for them. So they're not allowed. So, you know, they, they're, they're in the system. So Steffi will actually serve Grandma's chicken soup instead of studying because the headmaster is here. Who is going to greet the headmaster then? Steffi, you need to do that. <laughs> um, okay. Greet Corey Gitchmakusoy. Goodness. Okay. Well. We need to give him a tour and I need to have food. I don't know how to do it. Okay, well, give tour first, I guess. Uh, and hopefully don't die. We, we had enough of that in this family. <laughs> Where's, okay, she's not dying yet. Uh, maybe she orders a pizza because I, I don't, Darren is busy with the homework and I don't, so, <laughs> so order a delivery and show this room, I guess. And then also show this room. Are you going to call for the pizza or? No, the cat was near you, so you can, couldn't do that. I get it. Okay. The cat is like... It's like a quantum cat, it seems. Like, it's a very small cat, but they can't, they can't do stuff around it because it takes up all the space. <laughs> it's very strange. So, uh, get some pizza. There you go. And then go into another room so we can show that. Where do we have expensive stuff? We don't really have expensive stuff. Let's just I'll go, go there and show that me. room, I guess. Yes, I'm ordering pizza for the headmaster. It's, uh, I don't know if that's a good idea or not, but I'm going to do it. Come in, come on. There you go. Show room. Oh, of course we gotta show this room where the computer is. Oh, she has to go on the toilet. Oh, and everyone <laughs> aged up too. Oh my goodness. I told you there was going to be chaos. I was so sure of it. Where is the age column? There it is. So Darren is 62. Dirk is 36. Steffi is 34. Melinda is 14. Dorian is 12. Dean is eight and Duke is four. Uh, and what? According to my spreadsheet, he has two days left. But this says it's one day left. So that I, th I'm, I think I'm just gonna, you know, wait until he ages up on his own. Wait, did I, did I like do some weird thing? Or something. Uh, he has five days. Okay, nothing. Nothing is in sync. Wait, is this because? No. Well, it might be. So. No. I have a played token, so I should have played them all along. I don't know. Let's just go on the spreadsheet and just believe in the spreadsheet. <laughs> I guess. I don't know. 
Well, we're doing the tour still. There. Look at this room. Don't you like this room? It's fantastic. You have a pizza on the way, you don't need to cook food. There we go. Maybe I should show this room, I don't know. Let's let's go here. See if the headmaster follows. Show this room. Yeah, he's too. Am I not running out of rooms? I don't know. Java. Because you usually don't get to show all the rooms. Usually he just says, thank you for the tour. I'm happy with that. Oh, pop some. <laughs> she has to go there. Well, okay. Darren apparently had time to receive the pizza. So as so, soon as we have, oh my goodness, shown this room, I think the tour is going to be over. Maybe. Yes, okay, there's no reason to show me this room, thank you, I've already seen it. Then what am I going to show you? Like, what, what more rooms can you possibly want to see? Look at this fantastic bathroom. We have got to r have run out of rooms now. Okay, well, I'm going to end the tour because th this is getting ridiculous. And then entertain, call for dinner and have some pizza for good goodness sake. It was great to see your house. Yes, okay. Can I... Will he not eat that? <laughs> because it's a pizza and not... Well, Darren, uh, see if you have any leftovers. <laughs> we, we, we have that. So get that out. Put that down, I guess. There you go. And then if call for dinner. Will you take the hamburger? It's probably a very good hamburger. Maybe. I don't know. Hey Darren, is Melinda available to talk? No, she's at work. Uh, but you can wait for her if you want. I think she's gonna get home at some point. Yes, very soon. So maybe maybe he w she wants to wait. Uh -huh. Maybe. Uh -huh. I gave us all and maybe you can sit here and talk to the headmaster. I don't know. <laughs> Um, I think Steffi needs to go to sleep. Who's getting home? Oh, Dirk, you're getting home. Fantastic. Now, does anyone have any relation to the headmaster at all? No, they do not. But it's fine. Who's not falling over? Oh, well. He doesn't want pizza either. There, have some pizza. Ugh. Look at the time, I better go. Yeah. <laughs> you better. Huh? Melinda's earned five, 152 today. How did that happen? Because it says here she only earns 95 per day. But I'm gonna have her deposit 100 simoleons because because I can hi I'm Faith since my friend Eamon had such a great time with you the other day I thought I'd see if you wanted to go downtown uh do we I don't think so because Melinda thinks it's important to get into 
the private school, so I think that the person talking to the headmaster should be Melinda. She's quite bored. Oh, she's gonna go play some games first. Okay. No. Well, my memory has gone kaput. <laughs> it seems <laughs> she's not playing games, is she? She is um, going to talk to the headmaster. She was putting money in her bank account. You know, I'm just confused sometimes. Maybe it, it is a sign <laughs> that I should, should stop playing because I'm um, my brainy not worky. Well, we could flirt with him. I don't know if that's a good idea. So let's just smoosh about school and see how that works. Oh, they don't really need then that many points. They have two hours left. And they need eight more points to get in. And then all the children get into private school. So I'm hopeful. And this seems to be going well, isn't it? Well, try and do the smooching now. See if it works. Oh, well, he seems to like it. Okay. I'm gonna take a little screenshot about this. I don't know where I'm doing this weird voice. There we go. Screenshot. They got it! Fantastic! He's gonna go and talk to one of the parents now. If anyone is awake, they are not. <laughs> Darren is asleep, mm, but <laughs> the headmaster is just gonna, you know, uh, you can't hear me because you're sleeping, but uh, your kids got into school. The headmaster is impressed with your family. Dean, Dorian and Melinda all got into private school. Fantastic. So now she's really happy. Why are you having a bath when you can... You know what, I'm gonna take this. Maybe I put it outside. I'm not sure that's a good idea. But you can go there. And we can dance. Wait, if I buy a better stereo, will it be more fun? Because this has fun 7 and this is fun 9, that's not a big change, is it? It's just a little change, so I'm, I'm not gonna do that. Well, she didn't enjoy that, like at all. So go and play some sport. <laughs> See if you like it. might have mastered the study skill thingy and also done his homework that's amazing so i'm gonna wake this boy up it's quite late but he does want to go to college one day so we should have him do his homework and melinda should take a bubble bath once you're done playing and then you can also do your homework. And I'm very sorry that it's noisy outside. I don't know what they're doing. It sounds like they're using a chainsaw on someone's house. Or a tree? Wait, I need to check what tree they're doing stuff to. I need to know.
Well, I couldn't see them. But there's a big birch tree outside I really like, and they're not doing anything to it, so that's... <laughs> so now you can all rest assured that uh, the big birch outside is safe. <laughs> For now, you know, you never know with people, they keep chopping trees down and stuff, I don't like it. Oh, look, look how cute this is. You know, that this is, this could be like the sole reason why The Sims 2 is better than The Sims 4. <laughs> you know, just because of little details like this. And check this out, check this out. Look at the watch or the, the alarm clock. It says, um, something where's the oh so it's 20 to 11 or 12 well, that, that seems odd but see it moves and it tries to show the right time but i think the the hour hand is uh, a bit wonky maybe it will switch because it approaches midnight maybe it will pop over to the 12 number uh, when we get there Boop. yes we do so now it's 12.01 a.m. and the, the clock shows that you know <laughs> that's just one small detail but it, it, I, I'm really impressed by it I've always been that impressed by that because it's quite cool. And that they didn't keep that in subsequent games when they have the technology. Yeah, I don't approve of that. So, okay, maybe she will. Did you do your homework? Fantastic. Okay, then go back to sleep. I don't know what bed is yours, but maybe you do. I have a bed ownership mod, and I do believe that if I click the wrong bed, they still go to the right one to sleep. See, I'm pretty sure this is Melinda's bed. But I clicked it for Dean, so let's see what he does. He goes to his bed. Fantastic. You can't hover, hover over beds like you can in The Sims 4, but you know, it's it's okay. Okay, well, what sort of emergency are we having over here? Okay, Melinda is having a bath. Go over... Where are you going? Oh, I added an extra bath. Uh, just for occasions like this. And then I forgot I had it, so I kept not directing them to go there. Too bad. But now he can change Duke's diaper and put Duke in the crib. Because it's in, in the middle of the night. I think Duke is gonna have a uh, horrible upbringing. Because I, I really... I, I, I can't concentrate on everyone at the same time and I usually start from the top so the children are the ones that pay the price of being neglected. I don't know. But that's just how the how the cookie crumbles in my game, I guess. There. When did I say Steffi was due? Um, Tuesday at 9 a.m. Okay, so let, let's try and get the baby. <laughs> get the baby. I think it's only one baby. It should be only one baby. Um, 
because I have seven sims here, so she should be at the time she got pregnant. Um, I I think only one baby was was put in her. <laughs> Logic dictates, but now I have a mod that makes it possible to have more children. But I didn't have it at the time of conception, so who's awake? Oh, it's. Is Duke the only one that is awake? Okay, well, that's horrible. And also that music. I don't like it. Can I turn it off? No. Now we need some diaper change again. Dirk. Do. Why, why can't I? Do that? Oh, he fell asleep. Now he's sleeping. Okay. Well. I think I'm gonna unlock this because, you know. We can't teach Dean homework skill again because he already knows it. I don't think you can uh, achieve this now. But it's fine. He wants... He's in platinum. So he should be wanting to... Uh, do you get body skill from yoga or is it something else? I don't know. Well, we could do some jump ropes, <laughs> I guess. We could build, we could buy a workout machine, but since you can just jump rope, I don't really know if it's beneficial. Oh no, it's starting to rain. This is dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> you might get struck by lightning. He wants his children to get scholarships. So I'm gonna lock that in and hope it happens. You can call college. Alright, wait. It, it has turned Tuesday. I must update the spreadsheet with that information. Not sure why I must do it now, but it's it's a thing that I do. Oh right, because if the baby comes and I add it on Monday, then it's gonna be unsynced. Unsynced baby, we don't want that. We don't want any unsynced babies. <laughs> Let's see if you... Uh, um, <laughs> apply for scholarship. I don't know if you're gonna. No, N he doesn't qualify for anything. It's fine. Did he do his homework? Yes, that's. I've checked that multiple times. Everyone has done their homework. They can just chill now. Maybe you call someone before school. Um. You know, someone that you're not best friends with already. So, who... Oh, he's not best friend with Lisa, so he can talk to her. And they might become best friends. At some point. I don't think you can improve that relationship anymore now that you're you have 100 over here call someone else um davis they're already best friends so bob maybe he doesn't own a phone he doesn't Wait, I must, I must, um, I must check because he's supposed to live with Angela and she has a phone because Angela Pleasant, she was married to Dustin Broke, you know, and they had these two beautiful children, but then Dustin went ahead and left her for uh, Meadow. And they live over here now. So Angela 
thought, well, what am I going to do? I am going to steal Brandy Brooks. I'm going to steal the boyfriend from my ex's mother. <laughs> and uh, he hasn't moved in with her yet. I was going to merge these houses. Wait, wait, I must check so that I don't do anything stupid. But I think I already thought I did it. Um... He's on day four. Why is he over here? That's weird. Oh. It's because he's older than Angela. So, okay. There. He, he In my spreadsheet, he already lives in there. So I'm going to put him in with Angela. There we go. Would you like to combine the Sartor household with the Angela household? And she's called the Angela ho household because I already had a pleasant household. <laughs> so we're combining those. Now he lives over here. They will have to move. Uh, this is... They cannot fit in there. But I think they're going to have enough money to do that. Uh, but I'm going to do that once I play them. Also, I made these apartments uh, really quickly, but I kind of like the results. Um, now, where was I? I was in the dreamer household. I got distracted. <laughs> I just wanted to call Bob and he didn't have a phone because he was in the bin. But now he is where he's supposed to be. There. Uh, call again. Well, the school bus is gonna come, isn't it? So, uh, call Bob. Just talk, like really quickly, because you're gonna go to school. Everyone should go to school. Wait, did? Oh, he got he got his fifth best friend that way. That is really wonderful. Now you can <laughs> run up to school. Oh, that billboard. It really is in the way, isn't it? It's this one. I keep getting behind it like this. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, look, now they have the little uniforms. It's wonderful. Hello, Kiyoshi. Brandy, formally sort. Such or, you know, I don't even know what is Brandis made a name. I don't know that. Uh, might have it in my um in my this <laughs> in this Brandy Sartor. Oh, is she uh, is she a newbie? She is the child of Betty and Bob Newby. That's wonderful. Oh, that's how it's spelled. I spelled Betty wrong here, but it's fine. <laughs> I named Betty after uh, Angela, no, after Dustin's grandmother. But I spelled it wrong. But it, it's just a modern spelling, let's say. So maybe Brandy should uh, revert her name to, to a newbie. Maybe. We'll see. Oh, people want A plus report cards. And they're already having an A. So when the... Oh, what is this? The Bain Gordon Communications Fellowship Aspiration Value. Oh my goodness. To become eligible for this scholarship, this sim must build at least eight points of charisma skill. Oh, she has no charisma. So why does she suddenly want that? It's weird. <laughs> well, that's a whim that she suddenly had, I guess. I'm hungry. Brandy, can we check her pregnancy? I, I need to know. 
uh, if we do a pregnancy scanner, we'll, we'll be told who's the father and how many babies there are, but I'm sure it's just Dirk Dreamer and it's one baby. Uh, I just want to know how many hours are left. So it says, oh, it's like one hour left and it's one baby. Take care of the cat a little bit. It needs food, you know? And I did not uh, restart my game since I did this last time, so I'm not gonna do it again. It's not gonna be a first chat. See? <laughs> like. <laughs> I just checked. How, when is it coming? Now is when it's coming. Exactly when I predicted it too. I had it in my spreadsheet. It was 9.13 a.m. What is? Wait, what does it actually say in my spreadsheet? It says uh, 9.10 a.m. Yeah, so, so like three minutes ago. <laughs> Which is probably when I checked. Oh my goodness. Oh, I accidentally turned off cinematics well well I'm, I'm gonna turn them on now it doesn't matter now oh and it's a little boy and we are going to name him what did I say uh, Omar 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 right it's gonna be Om Omar dreamer oh wait is that a junior Name Steffi, where are you? Steffi, Steffi. Okay, so we have Omar Matlapin. So Matlapin, I don't know. So it's not, he doesn't need to have the junior name. Oh my goodness, so cute. I wonder, I know, I mean, I have always thought that the babies in The Sims 4 is awful. They are awful. They are like way, way too tied to the, to the crib. And they also don't look as good as these babies. Omar. There you go. We have our little Omar Dreamer. Save it before I do something stupid. <laughs> and I'm gonna add him in here. Omar uh, Dreamer. If I just do this then. Oh. Dreamer. And he is in a recorded household. Oh, now we're gonna check his parents. We have Steffi and Dirk. They're both with, <laughs> they had too many children. So they are all already furthest down on the scale. They are townies. So their child is also gonna get the townie flag. Also, we must set him to a life. I keep forgetting doing that, but. <laughs> It's fine. There we go. He's zero days old. He's a baby. And we don't know his sign. We can't check yet. But here's the glasses thing happening. Okay, so we have Steffi and, and Dirk. Okay. Oh, we can we can uh, double check, but I'm I'm fairly sure that we <laughs> that we know know that it, his of Steffi and, and Dirk. So uh, they have the number 63 and 64. They're really close to each other, actually. So what are we doing? We're going to random.com.org, I mean. Uh, so we put 63 here and 64 there, but then we also increase the range a bit. So I'm gonna have 53 and 74, and then we randomize and his, magical number is 61 
So at 61, Omar is going to get glasses. There we go. And that's all for today. <laughs> We got ourselves a little dreamer baby, and uh, Stephanie looks real happy about it, don't you think? <laughs> She's like, another one? What am I going to do with this? Steffi, you're the one that keeps having the want to have babies. That's, that's your doing. You don't get to be dissatisfied now. Uh, but she wants to raise 20 puppies or kittens, and I can't, you know, with that. <laughs> She'll have to focus on that much later. Now we are not opening this window. I'm going to go on Twitch and we're going to see if someone else is playing The Sims 2. Let's see. Sometimes we have someone else playing. Uh, Apparently, Twitch did not want to play ball with me. There we go. No, I am the only one playing <laughs> The Sims 2. Is someone playing The Sims 1? That would be fun, wouldn't it? Um, not sure. Well, let's do The Sims 4 then we will be able to find someone but none of the ones that i'm following is playing the sims uh for wait the life attack is playing harvest stella what is that our oh, commercial i hate commercials well, it, it looks cute. <laughs> so let's, uh, let's go raid her. There we go. So until next time, have a uh, super duper time. Stay safe. Take care. Stay out of trouble. Do your homework. Take your medicine. You know, be good. And I'll see you all next time. Bye now.